just with Hobby at Auto Craze, checking out these wheels. It's my boyfriend's got his car in there getting his wheels done. That's why. Boyfriend's new car. New wheels. new wheels. Not new car, sorry. My bad. <laughs> He's got the wheel guards and the mad black rims going on there. Nice. Hi my loves, it's Melinda here. I'm going to quickly show you guys how I tinted my brows using the men's moustache and beard dye. This is probably like every other dye out there. I don't know what makes it special, but it comes with the plastic container to mix the dye in, um, developer dye, and a big ass brush. So this is probably good for those who are using it for the beard and massage, but yeah, I don't need that. Um, so yeah, what is on my brows is the actual tint. The only thing I've done is just draw the outline of my brow with pomade and the beginning of it just a little to fade it out because I didn't leave the dye on long enough. Going home now, it's been such a fucking fail day because I went home here to fuel and my battery's running low. And there's my hobby. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna go home now because I'm tired and we're gonna go out and eat somewhere and watch a movie, I guess, because there's nothing much I can do. I don't have the internet at home. I can edit my videos for you guys, but I can't upload it. My boyfriend was suggesting me go to McDonald's and using their Wi-Fi to upload my YouTube videos, but yeah, I don't know how, this, how the um, internet is going to be because I need something super fast for me to upload. Sometimes it takes me like two hours to upload a video, so imagine being at McDonald's. It'll take me five hours. No, thank you. Anyways, I'm going to drive home now, so I'll see you guys. Bye. Yes, Korean barbecue tonight at Jeng Tabao and some soju of course guys today feels like such a long ass boring day um all I did was wash my car um sleep watch youtube videos and now I've just got ready to go to a friend's birthday and this is pretty much my makeup my boyfriend told me we're not leaving and she's like 7 30 so I get two and a half hours to spare so I don't know why I got ready so early, but now I've got nothing to do. Check out my background, my boyfriend's kicks, and my... Long story short, I won that bunny back in year two in a raffle draw, and I actually won a basket of chocolates in that, and some other kid won the bunny rabbit with a big gigantic Easter egg, and we decided to swap, so now I still have it from today. Yay! My boyfriend and I are going to go walking down the road because we live on the main street in our area so there's like shops literally down the road so I'm going to go take a walk and see if I can find myself a pork roll. So hey guys, I ran out of SL Auto double wear so I mean all the shops were closed so I had to go and find an alternative. So I got the Maybelline Fit Me Matte and Poreless in the colour um, 310. Let's just hope that this colour matches me because I did swatch it on my face here and on my neck. Um, and if it doesn't, if it's too light, I'll just go over with some powder or something. And I'm also using the Giorgio Armani Translucent Powder. It's like seven, 77 US dollars. Yes, yeah, so every net was selling it for like that much. And I thought, oh my god, it's so expensive. It better be good and it's freaking good. I bake with it and then I set my face with it as well. And it's like really, really long lasting. I only need a little bit as well. It makes my under eyes really bright. Don't worry, you're not in there. But my waist is now. Yay, guys, I got my Safu packaging. I think it's only half of what I got, but um, I'm gonna rip this open because I want to see what's inside. As you guys will probably know, I don't have the internet at home, so I can't do an opening, I mean an unboxing video. 
So I'll quickly show you what's inside. This, it's like swimwear, swimmers and makeup brushes. I can't remember how much this was on Safa website, but it looked like the, um, not real techniques, the other brand, Sigma brushes. So I was like, oh, I've got to have that. It comes with a case. I can't seem to like get it out. The case is so pretty. It comes with like a rose gold zip. Obviously made in, looks like Jap Japanese writing, maybe, maybe made in Japan. You guys, it's like amazingly soft, like oh my god. Except the flat top blending brush or buffer brush is not really dense enough. So I don't know what it's going to be like with foundation. But they gave me brush guards with it as well. I got these glasses as well, but like they are so huge on me. But they look so pretty. I also got them in the black as well. I think this one looks a little bit funny on me. But I'd still wear it out. I'm liking this Saffle swimwear. This is the only one that freaking fits me. It sucks. That's the back there. When you order a small but you get a large, it barely fits. Oh my god. And I don't have boobs for this. This fucking sucks. This is the back. The back looks okay, but if it fit, it would be nicer.